Hey, now we're ready. Hello, Brian, good morning. Hello. Brian, how are you? I'm excited for y'all to punch more cops. I'm I have a feeling we're going to punch more cops before the end of this. You know what I mean? I have a feeling we will definitely we will punch at least one law enforcement uh, robot figure. Before the end of this, it just it, it feels too likely. I tell the years change and it's a lot brighter in your room with natural light. Yeah. Uh, well, and then you have the days that are like overcast and dreary and it, and then it's dark as hell. Because. So Brian will remember this because uh, I sent him a video when we moved in, but right here on this wall, basically right past. This, uh, you know, on this wall here, right past here is our patio. So our huge glass door. So it really like Brian says really the light of this room really changes with the seasons but that's also why i got this ring light uh to have just a little more consistency and i've actually really liked it trout good morning trout hello how the heck are you how the heck are you sage sage good morning overcast and jury that's what's outside on some days on some days it's good you know, on some days you're happy for it. Some days you're like, oh, yeah, just, you know, just like a just like a night. Nice, not not when it's like gray and shitty, but when, it, you know, you just have a little rain. You have some cloud cover, so it's not too hot, you know, and you're just like, this is good. This is good. Is this light too warm right now? Let's see. No. That's too bright. That's a little better. That's a little hang on. See, and what's fun is then you turn it off and you're like, oh, this is how it used to look. Yeah. Shouts to ring lights, man. Shouts to ring lights. Now I got to stand at the bus stop for 15 minutes. Yeah. Not not what you're looking for. Not what you're looking for. Nobody wants shitty rainy day when you got to uh, when you got to be outside. But uh, yeah, good morning, everybody. I hope everybody's having a good day. Thank you for uh, thank you for being here with me. Thank you for spending time with me. If you're lurking, thank you for lurking. Thank you for being here. I appreciate you. Um, but yeah, good morning, everybody. Today we're going to be uh, playing more Brock the Investigator. Um, we're probably going to finish it um, today based on the fact that I think that when we saved on Monday, it said we were at 90 percent. Um, so probably getting through it today. Um, and then I have a couple special things planned. We'll see. We'll see how they go. We'll see how it all goes. Um, but I have things planned. So. Join a cup of coffee with some can of butter in it. Rainy day chilling. Uh, playing Beholder 2. Beholder 2. Oh, interesting. Oh, this is kind of neat. This is interesting. Yeah. We also have a game coming out called uh, the same publisher. Yeah, the same publishers put in a game called Necrosmith 2, which is a roguelike tower defense, which uh, I'm interested in. You know, Steam is starting to do this thing that I don't like where I try to click on the developer page and it goes to the publisher page instead. And I'm like, I don't. You know what I mean? I noticed that the other day. Yeah. And I don't know if it's like if it's if it's some weird thing where it's like, oh, yeah, it's an internal team. So it's like it's not its own thing. It's like, but I'm looking for for games made by the same developers. So this is not as helpful as you might think it is, you know. This is not as helpful as you might think it is.
All right. You know, I want to, you know, especially with with indie devs and, and indie studios, you know, you have like small studios that publish games by small studios, you know, and you're like, oh, I want to, you know, I want to make sure that, you know, I have, I you know, I know what this game is or I know who made this and I want to look into what other things these people have made, all that sort of thing. Speaking of which, the new uh, uh, Humble Choice got revealed. Uh, and let me tell you, this is this is a good one. I'm excited. I'm excited for this one. Here, let's let's full screen. We'll go over here. So we've got I'm I'm really excited for this. I'm really excited for this. 40k Chaos Gate. Um uh, I watched I watched uh, Ren and Rob play a good bit of this on Waypoint. Really cool, like eight out of ten uh, tactical strategy game where you all play as Grey Knights. You get a lot of like weird, silly Warhammer shit. I saw a, do a couple dogs running down the sidewalk alone. That's a good sign. Um, but like, oh, wait, it went past it went past the screenshot I wanted to show you. Come on, there we go. So it's like XCOM where you have like a, a a team that you're outfitting. And then your guys are like just this mess of, of weapons and skills and powers and stuff. Like they really let you lean into them being ridiculously powerful. And you can customize all the stuff on their armor. So it really leans into kind of like some of the Warhammer miniature elements. Um, so I'm pretty happy about that. It's really, really great pick for this. Um, like really XCOM time um, like very quickly you get the ability to like teleport and do reaction shots and all that stuff so I'm really excited about that um, behind the frame I've really been looking forward to to playing so this was this was a great little surprise I'm excited for this uh, Operation Tango is actually a game I really want to play with Brian um it is an asynchronous multiplayer game where one of you is an agent and the uh, like a like a secret agent and the other one is a hacker and you work you work cooperatively. Um, so like this is this is this is the agent. The agent is on it on the train or whatever doing the damn thing. And then the hacker. Is a hacker and doing all this stuff like that sounds it's incredible. It's one of those things that like. So I, I saw I saw the game and I was like, that's incredible. I, I really want to play that. Um, And then like Windjammers, I'll probably give this to Brian because Brian loves Windjammers. I'm not too worried about it. Brian loves Windjammers. I'll give this to Brian. Um, Spirit Fair, I think I already have. Um, Bending the Dark Revival is I think the second. Yeah, the second one, um, which I heard was good. Um, I don't know. I like I've heard Bendy is good. I don't you know. I don't have any emotional attachment to it. Builder simulator. Sure. And then I actually played a demo of this game. Uh, the invisible hand that didn't go up. Um, I did enjoy it just uh, uh, due to the game, but other people might. Other people might. Other people might be like, oh, like I, I, I like it's like it's like an economic simulator thing. But uh but yeah, this is May. This is the full the full thing. I believe we have a code. Yeah, if you want to pick up um Humble Choice, um I recommend it. I've I've been subscribed for I don't think there's any info. Yeah. I I've, I've been subscribed for a really long time. Um uh, a really long time. Um and I my rule with it is I keep it as long as like as long as the month I feel I get my money, I subscribe for the next month. You know what I mean? And so whenever that stops happening, that's when I'll stop. But Chaos Gate and Behind the Frame and Operation Tango for $12. That's that's fine. That's fine to me. <laughs> that's good. That's a good deal. 
hundred percent. I want to see more work by particular artists, not publishers. I don't buy albums based on the company that published it. It, it kind of, it used to work that way for music, right? Like it used to work that way because, um, um, you know, record houses, if they were small record houses, like focused on a sound and focused on having a, a collection of, of artists that sounded similar. Um, but yeah, it is, it is annoying that it's like, here's the publisher. And you're like, that's not, that's not what I want. Not what I want. So it might be a weird, um, it might just be a weird, like steam bug. Oh, and here, here, we should watch this. We should watch this. Um, come over here because this uh trailer just came out yeah a year ago storm finally young woman named Dahlia. According to the orphanage, she disappeared three months ago. She looks like the, Dahlia looks like the, uh, uh, who's her face that played, um, what's her name in Scott Pilgrim. Mutants and humans alike. What are you so busy defending, Storm? These cast-offs are not your family. This looks really good. I'm really excited. Um, I'm reaching the point with Midnight Suns that I'm glad it exists because I don't, I don't think we're gonna get any more DLC. I don't think we're gonna get a sequel. Um, like the guy who was the driving force behind this game left the studio immediately, almost immediately. And then this last DLC has had a, like a good delay, um, which hey, you know, delays happen. Um, but. I think so excited to fight for mutant kind. Uh, uh, my hope is my hope is that people go ham with mods. My hope is that people go ham with mods and um, you know mod in new characters and new stuff. You know, like that, like basically like the XCOM community has. I hope I hope Midnight Suns finds its community, finds its people. Really like this look of Storm too. It's a good kind of modern. That was it, you know, it fits. It, it, you know, I'm not super excited about the new threat room stuff, but it was a good way to test out fighting different people that happen randomly. It definitely feels like, um, hey, let's get a room that we can't think of how Storm would do stuff. You know what I mean? Like, uh, how, what that would storm bring to the magic school? Uh, I, I got nothing, you know, <laughs> I got nothing. Let's, let's enhance one of the things we already have. I really see how this interaction works against fallen Hulk. You can't just do that anytime. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Yeah, true. Very, very, very true. So it's a, it's a cool idea, but it's not, it's not very exciting. It's not very exciting. Um, but yeah, so I, I really hope I really hope the mod uh, the mod community picks up on that. Because um, I think I have a feeling I hope I'm wrong. You know, I have a feeling that. Uh, that uh, that's going to be that's going to be that. That's going to be that. Oh, oh, what was the other thing? Hang on. Where? Yeah, there's the link. A friend of mine told it, told me about this the other day. A friend of mine told me about this the other day. Citizen Sleeper is getting a special edition art book and tabletop RPG. 
<clears throat> Excuse me. It's almost funded, actually. It's almost funded. <clears throat> Excuse me. Goodness gracious. My my sinuses are, are are really messing up this morning, so I'm sorry for all the all the coughing and throat clearing. But so they're they're doing they're doing an art book specifically. Like it look like they haven't shown anything inside, but it looks gorgeous. Like I'm I'm jazzed about it. And then I'll show you the cool image of the deluxe edition. They're doing a vinyl, which of course they are. Everybody loves vinyl. This is the game Cycles of the Eye, which looks really cool. Yeah, so here's the deluxe version. It comes with everything in this nice like slipcase box. It looks gorgeous. Like it's one of those. This is one of those things where it's just like, oh, people who actually like. Appreciate art and good design like this looks gorgeous. So nice. Oh, man. Yeah, these look so good. And then and then the the premium hardcover art book. Such a cool thing. They actually have a. Um, they have a new game. They have a new game. Uh, Jump over the age. Put out a new game. Or rather, they have a new game coming, um, and that'll be one of the demos we play during um, during the the kind of Ludonericon demo uh, demo days. I'm very excited for all those flipping demos, man. It's going to be so fun. It's going to be such a good time. All right. <laughs> Let's get uh, let's get Brock loaded up. Oh, yes, yeah, some of the. Uh, some of the Loot and Aircon demos are. Coming out. Which is good. I have to keep my ear to the ground for anything else that comes out during this time. Sometimes people will put uh, demos out during special events. Um, to to try to get caught up. <sighs> oh. <sighs> I played a lot of I played a lot of Fortnite yesterday. I played a lot of Fortnite yesterday. Um I realized that they didn't get rid of the weekly quests. I realized they didn't get rid of the weekly quests because those are the quests they're using to control the bonus rewards on the season pass. Um so I was like, "Oh, snap." I need to do some season quests and get levels on the boat on the on the on the battle pass because I thought I'd missed it. Um, so between getting the stuff on the battle pass, uh, then there's a, the the Star Wars event came out of nowhere yesterday. The Star Wars event came out of nowhere yesterday um, that had a. Um, that had a battle pass that uh, I had to wait a little bit getting v bucks on the battle pass to pick up but uh you get freaking darth maul if you do all the quests so i'm excited for that it looks really good um it makes me wish i had gotten uh, a lightsaber uh because i don't i don't know if oh no you don't you don't get a lightsaber harvesting tool because the lightsabers are reserved for weapons, right? That makes sense. That makes sense. I just realized that. <laughs> Excuse me. Goodness gracious. Hello. There we go. So. 
Uh, search for graph. I don't feel good about it if I'm if I'm honest. Um Oh, the floor is all cracked. Maybe I shouldn't have jumped on it. But hey, look at that. An ad was hidden underneath. That's funny. No new mail since the last. What? That's so That's no new mail since okay. the last opening this morning. That's so That's really funny. I like how I was like, wait a minute. I wonder if I can break this. And it was like, yeah, you did. <laughs> okay. What does this Private say? Detective? I wish the. Oh, right, 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 right. So, where would Graf go? Hmm. Get, get. Just rub. Do this while I. Nothing. Well, I think rubble. Hmm. No. Hey, what's that? Sapphire, hello. Great. A two hundred units coupon. Gotta wonder who loses that much money in the dumps. Hey. Treasure obtained. All right, I made money. Sapphire, good morning. So we gotta find Graf. Um, I don't remember where Graf was. There's still time before my appointment with Wes. Yeah. Excuse me. With everything happening, Graf might not be the only one needing help. Better keep my eyes open and keep training. Got the feeling this will come in handy very soon. All right. Well. They made a point, they've made a point like multiple times in this game to say keep training, so. Oh, I can do an upper. Oh, I didn't realize I can do an uppercut. Okay. Oh, that's okay. I didn't know that. That's that's this is all this tutorial is already paying dividends. I should have done this forever ago. This is incredible. Oh, I can just hold B. Yeah, this is this is why we train. Yeah, this is why we learn. Wow. Hold down the special attack button to fill the gauge by using your own health. Oh. Hang on. Oh! That! There's a, a lot of really good fighting tech in this game. That's amazing.
Why are you just doing these like special attacks? Get out of here. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Amazing. Uh, we haven't done training three or four, so we'll do those, but yeah, Sapphire, hope you're having a good morning. Hope things are going well. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, that's... Oh, that's incredible. Ah! Open the crates and eat the fruits. Oh yeah, stick. Oh god, mines. Okay, that's... Oh, I knew it. I was like, I was like, if I do the uppercut, I'm gonna hit that. I'm gonna hit that thing, aren't I? Hell yeah. Love to fight drones with my bare hands. Oh, shit. Tiny. Oh, those are some, those are some OCS OCs right there. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my goodness. Just do all my cool special attacks five feet from him. <laughs> god. All right. Let's do stream readers here. Let's do stream rainers. Um, as a reminder, as a reminder, please uh, spend your channel points. Vote for the the games you want to see. Um, if you need to, if you need to go over, I'm double checking everything. Okay, double checking that while we're looking at stream rainers. Um, but if there's something you want to see me play, oh yeah, that's right. Um, I unlocked the game request, um, chatting with, uh, uh, was thinking about it and then chatting with some different people. And I was like, you know, open it up. Why not? You know, maybe somebody sees something on there that they're like, oh yeah, this actually, this would be really fun to watch, to watch Matt play. Um, you know, and everybody gets excited for it, then, you know, 
what am I... Why am I standing in the way of that? You know? Oh, ow. There was a B prompt, and I was like, oh, can I stop it? God, I can't believe I just found out about this uppercut move. I love it. I can't believe I just found out about this uppercut move. Mines. I don't like how I can just like walk up to them and they're just like bat, bat, bat. Yeah, keep. There we go. Yeah, here we go. Oh, I gotta fight D again? Oh, God. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah. All the training done. Did that unlock a new? No. Okay. You know, that's fine. Closed. She warned me. But this lock, that's new. A keyboard, three slots, noun plus verb plus noun is written down. Hmm. Looks like I need to enter three words. Uh, time is money. Nah, pretty sure I'm not supposed to enter a garage right now. Okay, well, how do you know that? Come on, video game. If I... <laughs> um... I definitely don't think I'm supposed to be able to be here. That's new. Please input your citizen certificate. Do I even have one? Oh, I do. I don't remember. Oh, man. Oh, I do. Mm. A bridge to the got no. I do. Rem I do remember when you uh, when you first scan. When you first scan in, they say. Um. Your your citizen number, and I went. I went. Ooh, I should try to remember that. Schoolbot, it's ready to attack me. Oh shit, Stubot! No, it's not following me. What was that all about? I can't beat up Stubot. It's not his fault. 
Hey, RJ. How are you? Great. Thanks again. But you look worried. Yeah. Wow. I'm looking for my boy. Boy? Gray cat, 16, blue eyes, and a kind of depressed look. <laughs> he looks He oh, looks depressed. Uh, you sure? Yeah, this afternoon. With a friend like Pig and Otter. Must be Ot. What were they doing here? What? Asking questions. Pipe Bell. Told him Squealer's plundered. Went to Backstreet. The Backstreet? Jalen! Jalen, good morning. How the heck are you, my friend? What did you get into? Gotta go. Wait! I come with you. Thanks, but I can handle this. My fault. Should have insisted. You gotta insist. Squealer's good fighters. Need my help. Doing good, bud? That sounds good. That sounds good. I'm happy to hear it. Who cares? Won't notice. Oh my, I'm good. Thanks, pal. We're gonna You ready? Maybe tons of squealers to fight. Once we are surrounded, we're gonna go back. Oh wait, hang on. No. Okay. Okay. I know I'm doing I'm doing good. We're gonna we're gonna finish this up today. Should I buy and uh we're gonna finish this up and play some different stuff and I'm looking forward to it. It's gonna be a good time. We're gonna have a good day. Nothing, nothing, you know, I'm like, hey, maybe, wait a minute. The slum, what kind of future is, okay. Hell yeah, it has been foretold. Uh, I did some, I did some Guardian games last night. I did some Guardian games last night and I got two, uh, I should put them in the, I should put them in our chat. I got two, uh, uh, three of the Terrapostasis, Terrapostasis, Terraxipuang, uh, Scout Rifle. I should put him in our chat here. Uh, I got one that I think is, is pretty dang good. Um, and I think you get you get one for finishing the quest that is pretty solid. Um, I think I think they they do the thing where they give you a pretty solid roll to start. Um. So, no time but I think uh, in danger. I think you know we're gonna we're gonna want to hit those. Come on. And uh, you know, gonna try to get those get those challenges done and in the street already. get all those unlocks, you know. Scum. Deserve good beating. If they've touched one bristle of Graf's fur. <sighs> Wait. Someone's calling. No. I'll find Graf. You sure? Trust me. Those squealers gonna get it. Hell yeah, RJ. Oh, I wonder if the tramp Oh man, I right. remembering that I let I the tramp you. die. I'll be back as soon as I can. Sure. Find my boy. Someone's calling in, so you have to, like, leave? I thought you wouldn't come. As you said, it's too important. I'm getting worried. Sin? Hopefully he just hid somewhere safe. By the way, Dr. Gherkin? I dealt with him. What does that even mean? Uh, it seems like he was telling the truth. I've obtained his signature and the procedure to fix the pipe pills. But as you know, this isn't enough. Something is blocking the process. How did you convince him? Well... Wait. Actually, I'd prefer not to know. She definitely killed that guy. Where is he now? Gone. She she killed him. <laughs> that's what, that's what that means. Where? 
The doc was afraid of going back to his job at the pharmaceutical company. He wished to hide while the situation cools down. Mm. I just to the closest country border. He's an important person. No trouble for him to get across. He left the country? Huh. Wait. What? But... He was supposed to give me ten grand. Sorry. He didn't mention that. Wow. Oh. Rip. I'm doomed to live in poverty forever. If it makes you feel any better. Soon, all slummers won't be living at all unless we get to the bottom of this. That's true. That's right. I have no desire to be the last person alive around here. Last? You're both here. Good. Go ahead. What have you found? Yeah. These last few days, I've been investigating the pill shortage. Uh-huh. All the pipe pills in the slums stopped working. He sure ain't coughing, never noticed. Yeah, no, uh, he's immune to it. He's immune to the, uh, to the, uh, pollution. We know that. Yet the drums are totally unaffected. I have reasons to believe the source behind the shortage is being run from the drums. By whom? Why is he immune? We don't know. Someone from the government, obviously. Let's not jump to conclusions. Although it's a possibility. But another important matter oh. could be linked. Oh, excuse I've been me. I've been with the police for 50 years now. Good. I have never experienced such a low recidivism rate. And that's a bad thing? Inherent gator powers. Definitely. When it's not natural. Criminals don't stop doing crime after their first arrest. Well. In fact, they never stop. Well. They'll do it again. And again. There's a lot of there's a lot of things that go into it's this. It's human nature. But lately, not anymore. Of course. They disappear into thin air right after their release. I suspect my own agents are responsible. Agents? Oh, you mean the Tribots. They oh, yeah. handle the release of prisoners automatically. And actually terminate them, guilty or not. They release them I into a pit. proof yet. But if they do, they're ignoring the judgments. Ooh. Or the judgments themselves are falsified. Excuse me. And who better than a Triangle member to undertake it? Possibly. In any case, this is hypothetical. That's why I need your proof. Here, on this memory chip, hundreds of documents linking the government to various shady activities, <laughs> judgments included. Good. I can reach some trustful, high-ranking individuals in various sectors. Undercover, they shall organize a revolt. Hell yeah! We're revolting! Spread the word. Make and distribute pills. How? With Tribots? We can't rely on those. There's more people than you think who don't enjoy this regime we're living in, Mr. Pork. Brock! Mr. P... P... Whatever. Mmm. I can organize this. But I need to gather all the evidence. This contains everything I have. The only copy that exists. You'll have to be extremely careful. Never connected to the Triweb. Uh, wait, don't give it to him. What? Why? You said we could trust him. Come on, there's no time to waste. Are, <laughs> Are we sure we should be trusted? My favorite game. Something's wrong. Care to explain? Call it a hunch. My instinct. And your instinct got you so far. That just seems like a bad idea. Decision. Yeah, it's not a it's not a good idea. It's a bad idea. It's a bad idea. Um, here, let me let me refund that for you, Sage. Reject so that it's refunded. Okay. Uh, hang on. Claim that. Twitch has new branded content stuff. 
which I'll need to figure out how that works. I'll need to figure out how the hell that works. Hell yeah, Jalen Retreskin control. Just give me a sec. I'll explain. All right, go ahead. Let's hear some of your famous nonsensical thoughts. <laughs> yeah. Here we go. You're Interrogation well, start. Old man. Yeah. All right. What is Wes hiding? Uh. Don't think I haven't noticed. Notice what? <laughs> my name. What about it? Go ahead. Say my name. It's Park, of course. No, it isn't. Uh. Brock, Chief. I thought you knew each other well. Yes. P p what? Just what I thought. You can't pronounce it. You never could. All these years, I've thought you've just been making fun of me. And that's not all. At several occasions, you've said some weird things. Confusing words with other totally unrelated ones. Pardon me for saying this, but do you happen to have any mental issues? Yeah, I'm not so young anymore. This is a personal attack, cowboy. <laughs> too incompetent for our case? <sighs> All right, good, good start, good start. Um. <sighs> so, uh, West oh no! Come on. I agree. This doesn't. Oops. I must be a link. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So that's not. So that wasn't wrong. That was just too. Oh, oh, oh. Can you draw something for me, Chief? This, 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 this. What? Go ahead. Draw me a sheep. Are you going crazy? This is ridiculous. So, can you? Yeah. I won't submit myself to those petty tests of yours. What are you trying to prove? He cannot draw. Anyone can draw. Yeah, normal human beings. It's, it's obvious he can't. But why? Fine. You won't cooperate. That makes you even more suspicious. Okay. Ugh. Come on. We don't have time. Do you realize okay. war will die if we don't? Wes. Okay. I was like, I, I was like, I was like, I, I think this is also connected. Checked the contents of your computer. How dare you? This is a second class crime punishable by. Save it for later. I found two protected folders. One of them was named D Silver. Hey, that's my name. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's me. That's what I assume. That always makes me laugh. Any explanation, old weasel? Easy. Can you remember who was in jail that day? Uh, I guess Sin was. Correct. I simply did some research in order to inform his wife. But you never did. I'm a busy person. We're understaffed, and that's why I hired you temporarily. You worked with him? Uh, well, that didn't go so well. And you're holding a grudge. That's why you're accusing me. Not at all. All right. This folder is suspicious. Yeah. This isn't what bothers me okay. most regarding Wes. Though I can't quite put my finger on it. Okay. Um. We've known each other for a long time, old weasel. Hell yeah. Why didn't you tell me about your accident? Accident. Five years ago, a police investigator suffered from a very serious air car accident. As far as I can remember, you were the only investigator at the police department. Oh, I didn't know that. It was you, wasn't it? Yes. And this is my personal story. Nothing to do with the affair at hand. 
Somehow, I doubt it. Really? Any proof of what you're saying? Um, let me think a minute. I'll find one. Pathetic. Hey, cowboy. I'm starting to doubt you've got anything tangible. This is what happens in the middle. Uh, trust me, okay? Okay, yeah, this is what happens in the middle, is it gets a little weird. It gets a little weird. Isn't it clear? I don't uh, know. One? Sorry. Okay, okay, okay. It's it's got to be this. The first time we met. Okay. RJ said you've changed. And now we know you're having some mental issues. Yeah, you're kind of old or dare I say an antique. Damn. But my little finger is telling me this all started after your accident, wasn't it? You know where you can put your little finger? <laughs> I'm the true culprit behind this affair. Oh, so you're saying the accident didn't affect your intellectual and judgment capacities? My intellect, possibly. My judgment, never. All right, if you say so. Stop being disrespectful. An old man will always stand behind his convictions. You must be right. I just wonder what his true convictions are. Mm. Seriously? That's do you have any Oh no, come on, that seems full of himself a bit see? And you're in This is what I don't you Oh come on anything concrete I will proceed as No worries, I've got exactly what's needed. Okay. Okay, it's the other thing. Okay. Did you know AIs cannot draw? And again, how is this related to our case? Well, Wes cannot draw either. You're trying my patience. We have a problem to solve. Even if it was true, what would be the conclusion? Indeed. I'm not really sure myself where this is headed. This opens a whole range of possibilities. So let's stick with the facts. Wes shares behavior similar to artificial intelligence, but only sometimes. Lost your tongue, pork. Not yet. <laughs> I mean, I don't want to mess it up, so I'm just going to use these. Okay, yeah, that's what I thought. Hey, old weasel. If I didn't know any better, I'd say you collided into a robot the day of your accident. Pray tell. Well... How else would you explain your inability to draw and to pronounce my name? Are you somehow controlled by an AI? Good. You keep sinking further. Gotta uncover the truth. Or dig your own grave. Uh, I admit, what I suggested sounds absurd. It does sound absurd, but also a lot of absurd things have happened already in this game, so. I need proof. All right. Oh. I found a proof of utmost importance in your office. I'm all ears. Dun, 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 a burnt down dun. power socket. <sighs> you should be ashamed of your moronic allegations, Pork. I'm not basing them on nothing. Only very old bots can cause an overload. So, uh, should I remind you the vast majority of our staff is composed of bots? Aren't they all tribots? They should be fairly recent. And this happened in your office. What would an old bot do there? I don't know. Probably some client. I can't remember. Really? Something's fishy. Mm. This had happened a long time ago. The power socket would have been fixed and clean. What's he hiding? Hmm. Let's summarize what I know so far. Okay. Wes has mental problems. Is sometimes that feels rude. That feels it feels like a rude way to describe that. An ancient robot connected recently in his office. You know. Much more advanced than the school director. Controlling him, and I've already met it. Uh, his accident. What if he 
No. This is absurd. I agree. Fine. I shall. Stop. I finally understand. Wes, you, your. Uh, interrogation complete. Not human. Uh, what is he then? An extraterrestrial? What if he was? What if that was the twist? Where it's like, he's not a robot, he's an alien. A bot. A very sophisticated one. Are you crazy? Did you take a good look at him? Have you ever heard a bot speak fluently like us? I do. The director of my son's school. She talks exactly like a human. She said she's an experimental model from years ago. And there's another like her in this city. An improved model. She was referring to you, wasn't she? <sighs> and I guess you suggest we open him then? There's an easy way to check. If he's a bot, he must have a charging slot in the rear. You have a good time with that, Brock. Go ahead. Search for it. Are you serious? <laughs> You're asking me to check the rear of Mr. Head of the Police Department? Exactly. Use the remote on him? Oh. I will. <sighs> I'm warning you, Pork. This is a first-class criminal offense. Ask Wes to show his rear. <laughs> <laughs> I insist. Oh, you insist. Oh, he insisted. Come on. Show us your butt, old butt. <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> if you truly think so, then I'll trust you. Maybe you can just show him so we can move on. <sighs> uh. Oh, my God. <sighs> Come on, show us your butt. I think that idiot with his moronic logic. <laughs> He's a robot. This is what you do when you find out when you're a robot and you're found out. Are you done? There's nothing funny. Oh, yes, there is. Ooh. I can't wait to see your face when you see mine. That was a noise. Well, that seems like it's, that's impossible. I was hoping I'd be wrong. You of all the people I've met all these years. That seems like a little bit of an overreaction. Could you be the one to discover my true identity? Then this means. Ah! No. <laughs> that's the Autobot I got from T-Mobile. Oh. Oh, good, good move. Good play. No way in hell where you probably come from. That doesn't make any sense. How? Why? You're involved in all this? What do you need it for? That's the only copy. By erasing it, poof. All proof. Gone. Pesky meddlers. You fail to realize that all our efforts are mm. to ensure this world won't turn upside down. Oh, excuse me, goodness gracious. We made sure every single device is connected to the tri web. We sent sophisticated algorithms to recognize and eradicate all inappropriate content. It was perfect. But this stupid non connected. They hired the Scooby Doo writers. <laughs> No one uses the word meddlers unless they're in Scooby Doo. Too bad for you. Very true. You're in my stomach now. In your stomach, better not destroy it. Um, good thing I didn't eat anything spicy. Enough. No. You okay? Uh, then this means sin. No, I've taken care of him, of course. No, this can't be happening. It already has. The most pathetic criminal I've ever always, <laughs> always back up your damning evidence. Running away from me as soon as he understood. <laughs> what a coward. You monster. Does your screwed up brain even realize it's contradictory to treat people as criminals while killing them? <laughs> Don't try to confuse me. We 
We've got to get rid of him. It. No, you're in luck. The old gun takes time to reload, but I'm prepared for all eventualities. Even this very Backup gun. improbable situation will show resistance. He's what? making this trash mountain collapse. Good news. I've proceeded as planned. He won't leave this place alive. Damn. How is that good news? It is for me. Obviously. It's bad. They keep coming. Uh. Oh god. No choice. I'll take care of the minions. Get him. Got it. Hey, guess what the penalty is for attacking a police officer? Let me guess. Death. You got that right. <laughs> Beat the shit out of this cop. Uh. Oh, hell yeah, double bounce. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God, I'm so injured. Can I? Hello? Oh, hang on. Food to D. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, yeah. No, no, beat up on him. Come on, come on, we're almost there. Yeah, we got him. Yeah. Oh my God, I did forget the remote. Hey, you're supposed to be dead. Don't attack me in the in the game over screen. I absolutely forgot the remote. We talked about the remote like three times and I forgot about it. My faithful bots. Foolish. They're not returning my calls anymore. That's it. The game is over, bag of screws. No. Till I. Ah! ah! D. My leg. I can't move. That devil. Come on. I'll carry you. Don't. Don't mind me. You've got to finish him. I will. After you're safe. Someone's waiting for you at home. Brock. Now, go. Oh, he's escaped. Where is he? I told you. That old snake. You can just smash the bot. Argument. <laughs> That seems Boy, bad. What again? Huh? This uh, is a nightmare. <laughs> what? How do you like my new shell, Mork? Do you even stand a chance against that? There must be a way. There's gotta be. Let me estimate. The probability you'll survive more than two minutes is non-existent. I'll take my chances. Good. I was worried you'd try something foolish like escaping. Well, would be no this is... You should know me by now, old demon bot. As long as I'm standing... Sonic Game Core. <laughs> fighting.
Okay. Uh, oh, hell yeah, the remote control totally works! Yeah, no, I busted I busted up all your shit. What are you gonna do about it? What are you gonna what are you gonna do about it, dog? You got nothing. Yeah. I broke all your shit. Done. Done. That was that was easier than the last fight. Not to be that guy, but that fight was easier. <sighs> yes. Hope you like this giant tin can. <sighs> For a sec, uh, I thought I. Oh, hey! I can't believe you've almost had me. Twice. That's not fair. I beat up your robot. The final mistake will cost you your life. <sighs> that hurts, you know. Don't worry. You won't die immediately. I'll break you bit by bit. Slowly. Let me savor this moment. No. D, stay there. It's fucked up. Um. Pretend to be dead, then maybe it'll put me down. Brock. Brock. Playing possum, huh? Don't think you can fool me. I have sensors. You know. You know, I'll take that. I'll. I'll take that. That's. Even a dead cat can bounce when it falls from high up. Oh, what you say? It doesn't make any sense. <laughs> one step ahead of you on that one. Yeah, he got, you know, I, you forget he's a robot. You forget robots, well, robots do things. Running out of ideas here. Before you kill us, I need to know. Why? Why insist on wiping out slummers? Isn't it obvious? <laughs> Pork, the first time we met. Many years ago, I wasn't a bot. Uh, to me, you've always been an old wreck. <laughs> After I was turned into this, I resumed my job at the police department. Slowly, year after year. I encountered the worst in humanity. Uh huh. Murders, thefts, aggressions, frauds. I don't know what aggressions mean. Every new case worse than the last. All concentrated in the slums. This is hogwash, the result of a buggy stack of algorithms inside your head. <laughs> no. It's a very reasonable way of thinking. It's not. A reasoning only possible thanks to my human side. Human side? <laughs> yeah, right. You see, I may look like a machine. I still cannot do high-speed calculations. On the contrary, I was conceived in order to replicate the human brain. And that never works I properly, so... memories from my past. I've never felt any different from the person I was before. No, I've simply been in the police long enough to understand. Humans never learn. Criminals always receiving. Bad seeds need to be eliminated. What a great word to use that like, 
has no explanation. This is the only way to ensure the safety of everyone who deserves it. Oh, the who deserves safety, boy. I, hmm. This is where, this is where if this was Intelligame, we would, we would chat for like 15, 20 minutes about like who deserves safety and the safety nets of society and, uh, you know, how, uh, how without those support structures, like, the reasons that crime, uh, you know, crime rates are so high and why criminals, uh, receive whatever the word is, uh, why criminals continue to do crime and all of this. Um, but I'm just going to say a cab dog, like, <laughs> let me guess the drum citizens, a cab, fuck this guy. Evidently, this part of humanity deserves to be saved. Uh huh. Sooner or later. This plague infesting every living being outside the dome will be spread inside. Why do you refuse to understand? Because you're a filthy piece of metal junk. Hell yeah, fuck that guy. Humans have a heart. You don't burn. Oh, he has borrowed something from humans indeed. The ability to lie. The prisoners that were terminated. You're behind that too, aren't you? Oh yeah, I'm... Absolutely. Of course. Yeah. My first plan. Back when I still thought a selective approach could work. How? Dr. Gherkin said three votes are needed. That's right. I'm not almighty. My power to take action has limits. Three votes needed to approve a proposal. One to block. So? I exploited a loophole in the system. He became the fourth vote. The ability to reformulate questions. Oh. Reformulate. Instead of, should this person be condemned to death? I simply rewrote it as, should this person be freed? Oh. The replies. Same thing, wouldn't you say? Except this way, only one vote against becomes needed. Amongst the crowd of questions we receive, no one even noticed. What a joke. Whoever Damn. that system was a stupid moron. <laughs> Not stupid. The creator is imperfect, like all humans are. The plan I concocted was safe, subtle, and simple, yet far from enough. I shortly realized I had to act on a larger scale. Taking more risks. And condemn all the slums inhabitants? Be realistic. Cheating, stealing, and fighting constitute the way of living for slummers. Yeah, I wonder why. I wonder why slummers have to resort to such, uh, to such means to survive. Hmm. Hmm. Just, just... Just think about it for mm. amongst you never did such a thing. Well, yeah, we aren't perfect, but everyone deserves a second chance. We can better ourselves. You cannot. Yes, we can. Silence! Wait, Leah's case. You lied about this too? I did not. As far as I know. It truly was an accident. A fire caused by the global power shutdown. The whole city was a mess. Are we going to find out that that global power outage was for, like, they were like, oh, yeah, we're bringing a super AI online. I am... <laughs> don't believe you. Granted, for all my career, this is the only case I couldn't solve with absolute certainty due to the data loss. It has always haunted me. You and me both, then. Shut up. We're nothing alike, scum. <laughs> Enough played. While you're still able to talk, let me know. What shall be your last words before I terminate you? Well, eat shit. I love you, Wes. Hmm. Hmm. 
I don't I don't like how I, I understand Sam, so Please, whatever happens, promise me you spare Graf. Graf. Hmm. He and I will be safe. I guarantee it. Well then, you need to know. They may be in danger right now. Oh. I tricked him. Who did this? Protocol oh. 26. You've derailed from the track that was assigned to you. It's my duty to step in. How dare you mess with my business, P-19? P-19. I'm right, and you know it. You okay? I should be the one asking you this. Yeah, I'm okay. Well, I just got crushed by a robot not for a little bit. Dead, but I almost wish I was. I thought we logically pulled Man, him. My body hurts everywhere. We'll get better if we manage to get out of here alive. Who, or rather, what's this? My son's school director, or so I thought. Huh. I mean, that is her job. I don't. Hey, piles of scrap pretending to be humans. How many of you are there? Only the two of us. I'm afraid there's no time to explain. No time to explain! Rock, let me handle this. Uh, okay. I've been watching you, P-26. Of course you have. I've attempted so many times to get rid of our positioning connection. And always failed. She isn't pretending? Yeah, no, she's very clearly a robot. Like, you look at her and you go, that's a robot. That's that's a bear robot, but that's a robot. Penny! Penny, good morning. How are you? What you want to do? Penny, how the heck this are you? the will of our creator. Who cares? He's no longer there. This isn't true. I gotta say, they really missed an opportunity by not putting Brock in a vest. You know, Brock in a vest would be a really good look. Brock in a vest, I bet, would be a really good look. I, you know... I can agree with that. Like, he's got to have the detective, like, flair. I get it. But a vest would look really good. Poke! Poke, good morning. He's still living inside. He's the no, invest a gator. I'm... You know what I mean. Well, that's stream, everybody. Um, I hope everybody had a good time. Um, uh, I'm never streaming again. That's it. That's, we're done. That's the end of it. Now get out of my way before. What? Ah! I can't break free. How? How can you do this? Release me, or you'll regret it. Not until you promise. Let go. Let go of your plans. <laughs> you seriously think I've went this far? I'm gonna think about that joke the rest of the day. Uh, that's gonna to do the right thing. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be eating dinner and that's gonna pop back in my head and I'm gonna be like Nonsense. I could say anything. Whatever you want to hear. How would you know it's true? <sighs> You're welcome. You're probably right. I would trust the human inside you, but he no longer exists. You we shouldn't have been allowed to live this life. Please inflict it on everyone you know. Uh, you can't hold me like this forever. Your battery will drain faster than mine. As soon as I'm free, I'll dispose of you and all those cockroaches around us. Hey, we're not. Actually, uh, he's making me hungry. <sighs> You're hopeless. Oh, right, they eat bugs. I'll rip open that crock to get that memory. Back. There you go, catch that Dr. Gherkin they mentioned. Thanks for the hint, by the way. I've been looking for the third member for years. I never suspected he was a human in the flesh. What was our creator thinking? How could you forget? We were all humans when the triangle was planned. Wait, does this imply the director is? Soon I'll be the only for this country. Oh, sure, of course they're the other parts of the triangle. That's dictatorship. What other choice? You're all blind. Who else is fair enough to make the hard decisions to keep Elijah on track? Make 
making hard decisions. You can't get rid of me. The same way I can't annihilate you. Otherwise, you'd be a pile of screws right now. This failsafe is implemented into our hardware. There's no working around it. Yet, there's always a way. No. No. You're lying. There's all... <laughs> But Mr. Brock kindly remedied this. Oh yeah, the 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 chip. Um, actually, what did I do? Stand back. The chip. What are you going to? Huh? No, it cannot be. You overblocked yourself. Stop immediately. <sighs> oh. Mr. Brock. Mr. Brock. Hey, Ot, this is a weird time for you to show up. Ah, this is a weird time. There's a lot of things going on. Where's Graf? Zenkai boost chimp. I'm here. Thank goodness. I was so worried about you. How did? I'm escaping. Oh, hey, he is a robot. Yeah, he is. Space. Saying good morning. How did? How did Graf escape? Fortunately, that bear was here. Where is he now? He gave us time to run away. Oh, RJ went in and saved him. Okay. Oh, I should have been there. But as you can see, things got even more complex. See what you've done, P26. Tom Glover entering room on fire, holding pizza. <laughs> hey, Mr. Brock. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Ninja Bear's hello. Yeah, um, so he's a robot. We fought him with a bunch of other robots, and then we fought him in the giant robot suit, and then now the director showed up um, and is gonna try to stop him. I think she's gonna explode. I don't know. By involving them, can you think of the consequences if- Oh, and, and these two are the other two members of the triangle. So. That sound is really annoying. Yeah, I'm not a fan of it. A single individual means nothing over the fate of thousands. That voice. Oh, Ott. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, Ott, don't look. You Who's the third? Uh, that, uh, uh, Dr. Gherkin. The, the crane guy. The, st uh, yeah, Stork? Crane? Huh? How? How can this robot speak like my uncle? Well... Don't don't let him talk to I. Don't believe them. I've tried to make things right. He's he's one hundred percent lying. The future of this country. Why are we? Wh Two thirds of the government were robots. Yeah, yeah. As as Jalen said, by design. But people refuse change. No, that's not what's happening. He's killing people. Your change involves a genocide, director. What are you doing? He's my uncle. Release him. No. Look at him. He's not. He never was. That's a lie. It will be hard for you to accept. Your real uncle died when you were nine. <laughs> it's like I like come please. What you see, it's a failed experiment. Don't listen to her, kiddo. She's my uncle kid. with red eyes and serrated teeth. <laughs> hey, that's my uncle. That doesn't know. If he's a fake, what about you? Right. Go ahead, break her. She she's not a fake. She's been this the whole time. That's not how that works. I I guess we're both shadows of the past. And that's why we must disappear. I I think I understand. Oh. No, no, no. Ot, please forgive me. Tell my son, tell Clay. Do people not know she's a robot? I, I don't, I think people know she's a robot. I'll always I really you. hope people know she's a robot because she's very clearly a robot. No matter the form I take. 
take. Promise me. I... I will. Goodbye. Are they gonna... Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it's also very funny that those two robots there are stuck from the boss fight. Um, Is everyone so okay? They aren't supposed to be there. RJ! Hey. Squealers are all down. <laughs> I love Arden. Hey. <laughs> all right. Hey. <laughs> I beat up those rat guys. So that's cool. I can't thank you enough. Why the explosion? Oh, long story. RJ, only you can prevent forest fires. Turns out genocide does have consequences. No. Oh. How? You gotta be kidding. That thing just won't die. He won't go very far like this. Who would have thought? Defeated by another machine. All these years. Yeah, I would just, I would not. All the arrests. The paperwork. I would just be stomping. My whole life has been a gigantic waste of time. A bit too late to have regrets. You chose this fate. No. That's not it. When I'm gone, it's all over. The country will fade into obscurity. Stop letting him monologue. It will extend to the drums. Humans never play by the rules. That's why. I spare believed in you. What in the French dipped fuck? <laughs> Can you? <laughs> this is a really good scene to just come in on and just be like, what? <laughs> this society cannot work. Zach, how you doing, buddy? We do what we have to to survive. Funny you'd say that, pork. Oh. As far as I'm concerned, you're the worst criminal of all. Why are we letting you talk? What you did is unacceptable. Explain yourself. Apparently better than this fucking guy. <laughs> don't deserve Graf. What? What? Hey, what do you mean? System failure. Rebooting. Operating system not found. The <sighs> fan. I guess we won. <laughs> There's something so funny about him, like system rebooting. Oh fuck. <laughs> What do you? Anybody ask me a tough question? I'm just gonna say system rebooting. What do you? That's... Don't let what he said go to you. That doesn't. He was a wrecked human inside a defective machine. Was he? Everything he said made sense in a twisted way. No, it didn't. No, it didn't. He knew something. Uh... No, it didn't. It very. It a hundred percent didn't. Like, please, like, don't. Everything he said made sense in a twisted way. No. It didn't. Forgive me. This is all my fault. Thanos did nothing wrong. Yeah, that had yeah, that has big Thanos did nothing wrong energy. <laughs> this is some centrist bullshit. Brock isn't very smart. Don't say that. Stop blaming yourself for everything going wrong in everything. Uh, you know, we've only just met, and you seem to know me so well already. Hey. A good journalist has to be a good psychologist. Our daughter, she needs me. I'll get her back. I know you will. I mean, you probably should. I could just, you can just tell people like, hey, I was right. The government, the government was doing shit. Hot. Don't give him the head. I'm sorry it had to come to this. Don't give him the head. Despite his plans to eradicate the slums, Still family to you. Just despite the fact that he wanted to kill you and everyone you knew, uh, he was still your uncle. No, 
Okay, good. Thank you. Thank you. To my parents. To everyone. Okay, thank you. Good. Can someone really be family? Can they spend their life lying to everyone close to you? That's not true! That's impossible! <sighs> Graf, how's it going, buddy? Graf. I... Buddy. <laughs> oh, jeez! That was. <laughs> Get bonked. He's still. That's. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's really funny. <laughs> Devil should have broken your neck. Oh. I'm gonna. <laughs> you. You'll never harm anyone else. That's it. Go ahead. Show your true nature. You see, Croc? Shut up. We're both vicious. But there's only a I like, difference between us. I like this guy is talking completely fine while getting the absolute shit pounded out of him. <laughs> Brock, stop it! No, no, he deserves it. He tried to kill you. This time, he won't get away with this. Mr. Brock, you can't do this. You're not a murderer. Brock, no, that's definitely not true. Everyone deserves a second chance. He tried to kill both of you multiple times. He did kill me in one alternate timeline. <laughs> Wimp. Someday, I'll get you and your boy. See, there, that's not, that's not the, I don't, listen, I don't mean this as a blanket statement, right? Don't take this as a blanket statement. But if someone tries to kill you and then you go, I'm not going to kill you in self-defense, because people deserve a second chance and they go someday I'll kill you and your son. That's not second chance time. That's mm, no. Mm -mm. No. Huh. He passed out. What he did. I I couldn't bear the thought. Craft just bounced. Uh, I know. Fuck, do I look like Batman? We're ending this story arc. Not the one you should apologize to. This man hates Brock with every fiber of his being. Uh -huh. Why do you have to? Where did he go? He left. Uh -huh. Mr. Brock, I don't know what the rat told him, but ever since we've escaped, he's been acting strange. Talk to him. Uh, I will. But first, D, let me help you. No, don't worry about me. I can walk now. You deserve some time with your son. You just saved our world, cowboy. Did I? It really doesn't feel like anything happened. Now that no one's in charge of our country, the world can run itself for now. Well, let us worry about this later, Mr. Brock. Come on, go. Okay. Thanks, everyone. Goodbye. Goodbye? That goodbye feels weird. You're here. I was so scared to lose you. Stop this charade. But I have a beautiful time. <laughs> I know everything. Uh. I love, I love how it's like, how everyone is like, oh, Brock, you're lying. And he's like, dog, I don't know what you're talking about. Like the whole game, <laughs> the whole game. He's like, dude, I don't remember anything. I've, I've seen it. The violence, that rage in your eyes. What's it gonna be? Drowned? Choked to death? I love... Okay, this is a thing that drives me up a wall in, 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 in any media, right? Because what happened here 
is that is that rat like abducted him, right? He had abducted Graf and then was like, yeah, look at what your old man did. And like showed him a picture of of uh, of Brock. Like uh, it looked like uh, putting down the uprising, uh, which, you know, bummer. Um, but then he's like, and he's going to kill you to take your money. And it like me, the person who's done violence to you is ultimately a hundred percent trustworthy and believable figure. So you should just do that. And Graf is just like, yeah, I totally believe you because yeah, it's weird that, uh, uh, Brock doesn't tell me about some things and thus clearly has lied about every single portion of his life. Like that, that is the scene that's about to happen is Graf is going to reveal that he believes what the rat that just hit him in the head with a pipe told him over, you know, great. Look, has, has Brock like lied to him? Probably has Brock like kept things from him? Probably. But it's like, dog, I don't want you to know that like I'm a detective that like definitely beats up people and struggles to keep us alive every single day. You know, like I, like I'm trying to, I'm trying to keep that. I'm keeping that from you intentionally so that, you know, like, you can have a better life. And it's, ugh, he's so weakened as a character by having amnesia. He's, he's weakened as a character because he has, he has amnesia and no one else does. Right? He has amnesia and no one else does. Everyone else apparently knows exactly what happened in perfect detail. You know? In perfect detail. So they're like, uh, Brock, I'm gonna get you for what you did. And Brock's like, I don't know who you are. I don't know who you are. I don't know who you're talking about. Uh, Brock, you'll pay for what? I don't, I don't know what's going on. And so it just, and so like scenes just feel so like, like, uh, 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 uneven because like you have someone that with like all this gravitas, like Brock will pay for what he did to me all those years ago, all that pain, all that suffering. We'll, we'll, we'll take it back and we will show him the consequences of his actions. And Brock is just like, I'm what? What happened? Who are you? So. What are you talking about? The reason you got with my mother, the reason she died. The reason she, the accident. The only reason you've been pretending to take care of me so far. Uh, I don't understand. Honest. Obviously. Listen. This has been a hard day for everyone. <laughs> also, it's very weird to be like, I don't understand what you're talking about. Like, yeah, of course. Like, tell me from the start, starting with your diploma. Like, what the fuck is going on? Not past, not me. You didn't? Oh, no. Does it even matter at this point? What happened? As always, the same thing. You. You're a drummer. What? Because of this lie, they inflicted a 40-point penalty. I think this is fair to be upset about, to be honest. That's a mistake. I told you, I was only a temporary cop. I'll tell your director. She will... Good luck with that. She just... She just exploded, didn't she? Yeah. Why, by the way? I'd like to know. <laughs> I'm... It's weirder. <laughs> it's weirder. <laughs> that she exploded and then everybody just kind of like accepted that that happened. Oh, she saved us all. I'll find another way. You know what's worse? You're starting to rub off on me. I couldn't admit defeat, so I tried to cheat. When did you cheat? You what? That hacker. He said he could change the results. Oh. I accepted a deal. How? Well, that was fine. What deal? <sighs> At least. Did it work? I guess not. He sent squealers after us. We got kidnapped. I. I thought we were going to die in those filthy sewers. You weren't there. Y'all have basically overthrown the government. Um. Yeah, that's true. I know. Like. I'm. We didn't Sorry. over we didn't overthrow it in the sense that now we are the government. We just sort of exploded the government and then left. I looked for you, but 
things got complex on my side as well, uh, to say the least. Yeah, I had to, I had to look for I was looking for you, and then I had to stop. But I don't care what the cops. Takes. You deserve to. I had to take the robo. I had to take the robo. I had to stop the RoboCop from killing everyone. I'll walk through fire for you. I'll do anything. You gotta believe. The government. Me. I too wish to explode the government. Just kidding, for any CIA agents reading the chat. Yeah. How far would you go, huh, to get what you want? That rat. It was him, wasn't it? See, I like, like, yeah, how far would you go to get what you want? Like, do you... <sighs> uh... Can't you see? He's turned you against me. He has a grudge. He was, he... Kraft wasn't, was like barely with you to start, like... For what reason? To... Say it! To turn you against him? Uh, uh, I'm not sure. A lie! Another lie! I swear, ever since the accident, I've lost some memories. And I know it's the same for you. Why won't you understand? Because I've got proof! Proof of what? Pr I've got proof! Of one picture. I've got proof. One picture, which the guy who tried to kill me told me the context of. Obviously, his opinion is the is irrefutable. Like, come on, dude. This happened at a Tarkism day. You're like, this is so clearly at the very least. Uh, uh like misinformation or misleading. And at worst, a, also a lie. You're responsible for the banishment of their clan. I could not. In fairness, he's a literal teenager who knows fuck all. Yeah, but that's that's fair. But also, he's a shit. <laughs> it is a fake, obviously. Really? Was it an Articism day like a thousand years ago? No, it was uh, like 10 years ago. Prove it. What part of teenagers did I make did I make clear? Well, look, I couldn't have this hat. You offered it to me when we moved into this apartment, remember? Oh, that's a good point. So I got this hat four years after this picture supposedly took place. I didn't I didn't know that about the hat, so it's a fake. <clears throat> good point. I don't believe it. Those squealers. They have no access to technology like this. You don't believe They couldn't fake it. Yet they did. Lot said something earlier. Can someone really be family when they spend their life lying to the people close to them? Oh, come the fuck on, dog. You said you had no more secrets, but you lied to me again. How many times has it been already? What? See, this is, oh, this is very frustrating. Photo, photo manipulation is so old. I just, Fucking teenagers, man. It's just so, just so nonsense how it's like, you lied to me about all the terrible things so that you didn't tell me all the terrible things. You're so terrible for lying to me. It's like, dog, come oh, on. I don't get it. Take a look. Uh, that bank account. That's my mother's name. Explain. Why didn't you ever tell me? It's my inheritance. No, she did open that account years ago. But this money... It's not hers. You mean it's yours? Not what he said. Yes. Oh. No, no way. He was right. Wait, listen to me. <laughs> he was right. Yep, that's... Maybe you won't believe me, but here in the slums, there's no way to open a savings account. When I was put in charge of you, I, I knew you'd want to become a drummer someday, but your mother... She was the spender type. There was nothing left. I couldn't bear the thought of you starting a life under the dome with zero credit. So I saved up money on this account for you. <clears throat> You're right. I don't believe it. It's the truth. 50 unis each day by automatic wire transfer. It's been almost six years. Bank drama. <sighs> I... I wanted to make this a surprise for the day you'd move to the drums. Newsflash! This will never happen! <sighs> okay, but that doesn't... Wait, wait. That doesn't mean he was lying. You're telling me 
We've been living this horrible existence. Despite having access to all this money, all these times I've been starved, miserable, for nothing? Mm. Oh, come off Not it. for nothing. 50 units alone ain't much, but accumulated over six years, it would give you a better life outside of this junk area. For your future, you little shit. Yeah, like... <laughs> This is like getting mad that uh, people put like people put money away for your college funds. Like, I didn't have an Xbox because you saved money for college. Like, dog. A better life. You know how you could achieve this by getting out of it. Please, don't. I, I'm really sorry. Sorry won't cut it. That squealer was right. He was not. You only bring problems to all the people around you. Listen. Get out of here! That's 91,250 unis in case y'all were curious. I'm almost an adult. That interest ain't bad then. I don't need you anymore. Okay. You're being unfair. I'm almost an adult. I don't need you anymore. All right, fucking go on. Can't you see? I did all of this for you. I just saved our world. And that's how you repay me. That's without interest. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, that's pretty good interest. Like, that's almost 10,000 unis over 10 like that's that's good interest saved from my point of view you just destroyed that robot no countless bots you've destroyed our rulers yeah that's fine yeah that's okay that's still good my teacher i didn't do that Ot's uncle i didn't do that either and if we hadn't been here you would have beaten that squealer to death yeah that's fine that guy sucks ass and who knows how many others destroy that's the only thing you do. It's called a revolution, kid. You destroy everything around you. Everything's your fault. Hey. Ah, don't touch me. What is this? Stay away. I, I can defend myself. Are you afraid of me? You know I'd never hurt you. I, I don't know what to think. All I know is I don't want you around anymore. I'm sick of your lies. You've been using me. All you care about is the money. The... M well, guess what? The, the money is gone! The money that he put away? What? I paid the hacker with it. A hundred thousand unis. And now, I guess they've evaporated. Vanished. Are you insane? What have you done? For years, I killed myself to save this money through blood, sweat, and tears. Work? Is that a new word for stealing? Like you did with those squealers yesterday? Yeah, I don't steal, How dog. could you do this? I had no choice. I had to try and fix the mess you've caused. The mess I have caused? Listen, if if the 100,000, if he wanted, the money was his, right? If he wanted to spend the 100,000 unis to pay the hacker to be able to be a drummer, that's fine. He's a shithead about it, but that's you fine. That's his money. Easy for me. I never asked for any of this. I had never raised a child, and I shouldn't. No kidding. <sighs> My mother. I barely remember her, and yet I hate her. All she ever did was make me and die. How dare you? I forbid you to talk about your mother like this. Who cares? I... She's dead. Stop. Now you've gone too far. What are you going to do? Kill me? Like you killed her? I never. I come back after a busy working work at the. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, hey, everybody. I want I want uh, I want to I want to rewind to a couple minutes ago where I was like, yeah, Graf is just a shit. And uh... <laughs> oh, I don't blame you for this. She deserved it anyway. Jesus Christ, Graf. She was trash. A bag of decaying worms. Like you. Enough. I just learned how to do that uppercut. I'm going to uppercut him. Oh. Uh, no. Fuck. Graf. You. You're okay. Jesus. Leave me alone. You heard me. Go. Son. No! I'll never be your son! Graf is actively You're actively terrible. Mother. You'll never be! Oh.
The little padding sounds are very funny. <laughs> it's over. I'm stuck in this dump forever. I I don't deserve this. Yeah, see, again, we're, we're talking about what people deserve. Maybe I do. <clears throat> my back hurts. Must be my punishment for saying all these things. You know, you start rooting for this kid and hoping he gets a better life, and you, you get here and you just want to punch him in his face. He oh. saved us. Saved me. And once again, all I did was... <clears throat> see, this is, this is the thing that really annoys me, is... Graf and Brock have these scenes where Graf is a shit and then he leaves and he goes, oh, you know, Brock did really do all of those things. Maybe he's not such a bad guy. Maybe, maybe I, you know, maybe we should get along better. And like, like they had that scene not that long ago, not that long ago where it was like, you know, yeah, you know, like we've, we've had some struggles, but we need to come together, you know, as, as, as two people, maybe not as a family, but as like two people stuck together and, you know, we can, we're gonna we're gonna get through this like it'll be great you know understanding let's go and then <laughs> he gets kidnapped and the guy who kidnapped him is like yeah well, you're, you're he's a terrible guy and he's done all these terrible things and you should totally believe me and grav goes oh i totally believe you 100 percent like uh and he has zero zero character growth anyway yeah if he had started as a shit and it oh I don't deserve a good future. It's my fault. Uh, I wonder if this would have changed if, if I hadn't checked the mail as Graf. If he didn't know about the bank account. I wonder what this chapter would have looked like. A notification? <sighs> oh. It's that guy. This is the creator. This is the creator because when um uh uh when when the guy when the uh uh what's his name when the police chief rebooted he said he said NMER version 0 0.9 Also this is why you shouldn't just like uh randomly message people on message boards about how you hate your parents Especially like this, like. Oh, I have a theory. I have a theory. Trust me, Graf. Okay. <laughs> the creator of the Christian God this game randomly references. I'm sorry, but I need to ask. <sighs> mm hmm. Uh huh. What? Yep. I have a theory. What I have to do. <sighs> Maybe going down this alt-right pipeline's a bad idea, Graf. <laughs> I think I understand. Maybe I shouldn't be watching so many videos about how uh, women enjoying video games is destroying Western civilization. Today, D said I saved our world, but it feels more like an ending to me. Like, I wasted the biggest part of my life. Lost the remaining person I truly cared about, who kept me living, surviving thus far. Graf, you're right. The more I try to make things right, the more I ruin your life. Was this really my plan from the start? I... I can't even remember. Only one mm -hmm. thing is for certain. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it feels like the ending to a video game. Okay, so I have a, I have a theory. You'll never live your dreams. I have a theory. You'll never become a drummer, Graf, Leah, everyone. 
I hurt everyone who gets close to me. Maybe I'm truly cursed. Maybe, maybe it's time to end this once and for all. <sighs> no, I, I can't stop fighting yet. I just don't know how to quit. There's definitely going to be an evil robot uprising like tomorrow. Go. So tomorrow's another day. Like literally in like five hours, mm -hmm. there's going to be a, an evil robot uprising. Um, letter. Hi, Brock. Forgive me. Blaming you for everything that went wrong in my life. This wasn't fair. I know. You didn't take me for the money. So there's an achievement that says, uh, that mentions, uh, translating this. Yet. And that's truth is, interesting. I can't go on like this. I guess this will come as a shock to you, but let's face it. Things never really worked between us. I'll be 16 in a few days. An adult. 16 is too early for to be an adult. I can take care of myself. No, you can't. There's no reason for me to rely on you anymore. I've been a burden for too long. I've decided to live my own life. Soon, I will pay you back all that money. I'm determined. I mean, that's your money, so... I'm leaving, and I won't be coming back. Please, don't follow me. Don't call me. Just go on with your life. 18 is too early to be an adult for almost every 18-year-old, so... Oh, yeah. Also, yeah. You have the right to make a fresh start for yourself as well. Thank you for the few moments of joy we've shared. I will never forget you, Graf. There's a PS. There's oh, absolutely a PS. Please. He's gone. There was absolutely a PS. I there was a whole lot of more words in those letter. Lost him. What? What am I supposed to do now? You say I should make a fresh start. How could I ever do that? Grandpa, Leah, and now you. If only I had another chance. Wait for it. I do things differently. Wait for it. But it's too late now. Envelope falls. What did Brock do? What was the big reveal? Oh my God, Jalen, so much has happened. Oh, yeah. Shay. I've hidden something from you. Be a detective. Hmm? That's all? Yeah, nothing else. What does she mean? And how could she know? Your friend, the time travel. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Giving me food for thought. Oh, oh no, I hate when so much happens. <sighs> It's better to do right now. It's only fun when multiple things happen at once. When they happen in a row. What has Shay been hiding? Okay. What has Shay been hiding? Oh, um, this one and this one. Yesterday, when crossing the dark alley, I had an awful feeling. It seemed like I just woke up after dying. I've had many fights in my life. Several times I've been on the brink of death. Yep, we're figuring it out. I have never felt this before. Is Brock a baddie bad? No, no, <laughs> actually, well, no exclamation, uh, uh, asterisk just because the game might reveal more stuff to us. But as it stands now, no, what Brock is fine. What's that? Graphs, graphs some shit and believes anybody who tells him anything. She doesn't think anything could happen to me. I've noticed it many times. Of course, this could simply mean she has great trust in me. And I thought as much, but now that I put these facts together, there must be another meaning behind this. So a teenager? I mean, I wasn't that stupid as a Did teenager, and I was a stupid teenager. Through some unusual means. Graf is horribly gullible. I, Graf, Graf has like understandable trauma to to deal with and work through, and like, like, he's definitely dealing with issues, right? Like, like nobody, nobody. Uh, uh, would refute that, but dog, like the fact, the fact that he just believed everything the fucking squealer guy told him is bananas. Um, okay. Ever since Shay announced she was closing the garage for the day, I had a feeling she was hiding something from me. We've known each other for years. This has never happened before. So what are the, oh, um, the squealer told Graf that, I'm sorry, I'm so confused. No, you're fine, you're fine, you're fine. Um, so the squealer told Graf that Brock is responsible for the squealers being banished. 
Um, but he didn't explain how. Um, it, it implies that Brock was on the side of the government when the Squealers rose up against the the the, the government at the time. Um, but the Squealer also t also told Graf that Brock was only taking care of him because of the money in that bank account. Uh, basically, was like, yeah, when you turn 16, it'll be your inheritance, and then he's going to kill you, and then he gets the money. Um, and Brock told Graf that uh, that was money that he had been setting aside for a while uh, so that when uh, Graf went to live in the drums, he would have money. And 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 Graf was just like, yeah, I believe this rat that kidnapped me and, and tried to kill me and made a joke about blowing up my friend and made me choose if I wanted to blow up my friend or 12 random people. I believe this man wholeheartedly. So it must be very important. What's the only thing she wouldn't let me take a look at? That new invention. What could it be? Okay. I... Hmm. <laughs> um, hmm. What? Okay, come on. What do you what do you want here? Open this one. Oh. This letter. She knew. It's obvious. She knew I would have one of the worst days of my life, spiraling into this bottomless pit I'm currently in. But how? Yeah, I'm often depressed, but never that much. And if she did save me in that alley the other day, how could she anticipate it either? This sounds crazy, but can she somehow predict the future? Yes. I'm starting to want. I. Oh wait, this and this. Uh... Listen, this is what these are here for. Picture of Brock, four years. Okay. That picture is intriguing, to say the least. I don't feel like this is where I would go in my line of thinking, but. Graf is right. It can't be fake. Those squealers do not possess the appropriate technology. It's also pretty clear their leader's hatred against me was genuine. He expressed it as soon as he recalled me. That darn squealer was ready to take revenge. Otherwise, he wouldn't have gone as far as kidnapping Graf and trying to kill him. But I hadn't met him until two days ago. And though you don't know what they can do? That, it seems... I didn't even get that hat until four years later. It seems really weird to be like, ah, oh, they don't have the technology. Okay, so like someone gave them the photo? So like what's somebody something? was just like, here's a photo, dog. Either I've got a doppelganger or this really happened. Okay. For sure, there are weird things happening. I'm all about doppelganger theories, but probability of that happens is, is I'm never. all about doppelganger theories is a funny sentence and it's clearly me that picture which means I was there four years ago and that feeling in the dark alley it felt like uh, a memory as for Shay predicting the future uh, I don't think such a thing is possible Shay is a scientist and she often says this when there's too much coincidence it's no longer a coincidence so that leaves only one possibility. Could the events currently happening have already happened? Even if I'm not aware of it, maybe they've been changed. I'm becoming afraid of what I'm about to find out. It's fine. Um. I'm start. I... Come on. What do you what do you want? Okay. It's pretty obvious. All the items she asked me to retrieve are parts for this new invention. But I'm left wondering, 
What could she need this ultra-precise timer for? Maybe this chit-chat about space-time theories wasn't so random after all. It definitely wasn't. Ugh. Okay. So, memories and proof of things that didn't happen. You and your obsession with space-time theories. Uh -huh. And I seem to be the only one experiencing this. Again, I don't believe in coincidences. So, Shay, it's your invention, isn't it? This is totally a crazy thought, but can it alter events? Mmm. Oh, hang on. Clues about what she has been working on. I, I found that. Remember its shadow. An egg shape is quite unusual. What Dr. Gherkin said earlier stuck with me. Mm. Eggs are used to symbolize loops. Which is weird. I know Shay. She never does anything without a purpose. If she chose that specific form, it must be crucial. So this new machine can uh, loop? If only I knew what this means. Shay, why do you have to be so secretive? Uh, this, this? Shay would have used that machine to save me. I had that encounter with the Squealer leader. Their defeat never happened, which is why I can't remember it. Wait, that doesn't make any sense. How could an invention change an event that already definitely happened? Unless, uh, time loop. Mm. No way. She's building a... Interrogation I... complete. Am I losing it? Wes, a robot determined to destroy our world? That was already totally nuts. But this... What a day. <sighs> nah, I must be wrong. It's been a long day. My brain is a mess. I've simply made way too many assumptions. For all I know... She's probably building a giant coffee machine that can wash itself. That's it. Or even a brainwashing robot that cuts hair. Sure. Hmm. Huh? That's right. What a fool I am. There's another possible and much more logical explanation. Could that machine suppress memories? Did I already use it? That would certainly explain a lot. I'm mm. getting confused. Ugh. Oh. My head. Oh. It's more than I can handle. Oh. Stop. I I have to go out and see for myself. But before that, just in case you come back. Shay, are you offering me a chance? Or did you take parts of my life away from me? Maybe both? I'm dizzy and anxious, but I need to know. Yeah, I... There's so much happening. There's so much happening right now. Okay. I was like, we haven't had a chance to really save yet, so. Picture. Is this a clock? So. Hmm. If I'm not mistaken. Oh. Maybe, maybe it's. Is this a clock? Time. Erases. Memories. <sighs> Master Brock, I was expecting you. Huh? You are right on time. Everything is ready. Great, but what is ready exactly? <laughs> yeah, hey, what's going on? Take a look. No way. You built a Dragon Ball Z hyperbaric time chamber? Could she really build a machine like this? With some junk collected here and there? That's the shell. The junk is inside. Well, sure. Oh, hang on. Nice. An ad coupon. Nice. There's no handle or anything. Shay, you in there? She's not inside, Master Brock. Just checking. Oh, there's a slot. It's obvious. I'm supposed to place something here, but what? Uh, look at this. It's look at that. A 
chronology. Huh. I won't think twice about this. I'll set it to five years ago, a week before the fire. This way. Either I'll be able to change the events, or I'll lose all memories of the past five years. It's fine either way. Oh. No doubt about it. It's glowing. Brighter than ever. Made of heptamide. The most powerful machine must need the most powerful energy source. Whoa! It's working! My pendant. It's not glowing anymore. Did the machine absorb its energy? So, how do I... Stand back. The egg... talked? Oh, is it just like... This is it. After I enter this, there's no turning back. My fate will be changed forever. <sighs> I make another save. Just I have to do this. Oh boy. Good thing I'm not claustrophobic. Say, I'm trusting you on this. Let's go. Starting in three, two, one. Goodbye, Master Brock. When you come back, please remember me. I definitely won't! Ah! Good luck, bro. So... Save me. Save us all. Say... Wait. Save me? What? Excuse me? What's this place? Hey, this doesn't look... This can't be the inside of the machine. Can it? <laughs> when the French pressed fuck? Um, whoa. What the? Do not pay attention to my appearance. Who are you? A remnant from your last passage here. What? Last passage? This is the place where all memories are shared. My memories, not just yours, this whole universe. Wait, have I been here already? I thought you would have realized by now. Everything has already happened. I mean, sure, if you're talking about... Everything will happen again. If, if you're talking about a time machine, like, of course, yeah, everything's already happened because if you have the ability to travel through time, all of existence has already happened. I have no free will? Like... I'm responsible for banning the squealers, but I do not want that. If I go back, can I change anything? You can. Ask yourself the real question. <laughs> French multiverse bullshit. To... Hmm. Yes. I want to change destiny. Not for me. No, destiny's great. Don't listen. Like you know, they've got they've got some issues. You know, like they're just stuck on that old engine. But destiny's fine. Don't worry about it. Destiny's okay at best. Yeah, listen, Destiny's fine. This is a long journey. I have a good time. But at the end of it, everything will be fine. How can I trust you? Trust yourself. It all depends on you. Thanks, Mufasa. Thanks. Past me or whatever you are. All right, it's time. At that instant, my consciousness seemed to fade away. I was slowly slipping into the unknown, into the void. My last investigation was completed. For the last three days, I had unchained the slums from a perilous threat. Yep. But I failed to extricate from my own fate. So many thoughts came to mind. I tried my best to hold on to a single one. I could care less if my whole existence would get erased from time and space. That's weird. I could care less if I would lose all my memories. Only one thing mattered. You. All these years, you were there. I wouldn't have had the strength to go on without you. This is why I'm gonna fix my mistakes. I'll make things right for you. I won't give up. 
No matter what, as long as I live, I'll find a way. I will rewrite history for you because I love you, Rav. Canonical. Oh. Okay, me. Well, there we go. Thank goodness the pills are back in stock. Okay. You know what happened? What happened? An act of God. Oh. He has shown mercy upon us. She said God. Christian Christian God confirmed. All these all these animals are Roman Catholic. We've confirmed it. That mess with the pipe pills. Of course. A messenger from the Almighty. Yep. After all, we are all his flock. Even those who doubt as you do. I suppose so. <laughs> I mean, I guess. Big sale, folks. Lovely little statue. Only ten unis. So what was the ending? The ending was uh, Graf went or uh, 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 Brock went back in time to try to fix his mistakes, uh, which work. probably oh. wasn't oh, no. successful hey, because that's where we are. You know what I mean? I feel like expect some very minor voice actor to be Matt Mer. God, that'd be so funny. You know what happens when you don't pay. You had the boy. You're the one who screwed up. Yeah, that's on you, bud. Shut up, guys. Yes, boss. Uh, this nightmare will never end. Maybe it's time for a new career. I wonder if we can save Sin. Mom missed you so much. You've been fighting bad guys, huh? Hey. Why is your you know? Why is your child a small well, British child? Ah, you're really clever. Mom, now you're here. Can Daddy come back, please? Um, I'm sorry. Sweetie, Daddy won't come back. You're wrong. What? I know he will. He promised me. Oh. Someday. I wonder if he, I wonder if you can save Sin. Him again. I wonder. Of course. <sighs> You're tired. Time to sleep. Hmm. I'm here for you. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. Good night. Good night, dear. I'm hopeful after the ending sequence we unlock like a big map of all these decisions because I'd be very ah, curious to see. I'd be happy to hear this bickering. I'm, I'm curious to see what time. sort of uh, other sure about this? options there are. Yes. I'm leaving. Leaving? To where? Anywhere. You, you can't just do that. I thought you'd be happy. Time to explore the endings. Yeah, we'll 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 uh, I'd just like to understand. We'll see how easy it is. It's you simple. know. I've never been this close to losing everything, and this made me realize I don't have much at all. I've spent Yet my life in silence, day in, day out. Now, I just want a normal life. I understand. Someday, I might do the same. I, I'll miss you. <laughs> Me too, friend. Well, to a new journey. Yeah, good for them. Good for him. Why does this guy look like the canonical ammo for his demons? Hey, name's RJ. Why you call me? Well, my uncle's gone. Not sure if I should do this. 
or even if I can. But the slums need protection. I can't do it all. Not alone. Why would you? Are you in? A cop got fired. You kidding, right? You even kept your uniform. Doesn't that uniform mean anything to you? I'll hire you back. Can you do that? Of course. I can't rely on these tin cans, especially after what happened. Thank you. Whoa! Just don't crush me. I need to be alive to run this place. Okay, so this song is the voice actors for both uh Brock and Graf. I don't even know why I'm here. It's not like you left any belongings here, Mom. Hmm? On the screen. Clay, this is goodbye. I only have a few seconds left to send this message before my body fails me. I don't know if you had to include that detail. I am about to give my life to save the slums you despise so much. That's not gonna help. To be fair, I should have died years ago. These are a lot of I was living on borrowed time. Strange things to you. to say to your child. To see this exceptional man you've become. He's kind of a shithead. I've loved every second, but that time's passing. Please understand, living isn't easy. Thinking for yourself, doing what you really have to. It's time to make your own choices. I hope I taught you what's right. Be strong, son. Please be nice to everyone. Wherever I am, I will watch over you. Love you. Mom? Awaiting orders. Stubot? Shoot. I'm not your master. Yes, you are. Really? Cool. That. Then, um, Let's go destroy the slums. I know. You're the new director. That's it. Now do your job. Exactly the sort of Great. terrible. Yep, exactly. It's the sort of terrible decision Clay would make. He just crushed it. Crushed it. Thanks, Clay. You nailed it. You did such a good job, buddy. You did such a good job, buddy. Love it. You nailed it. 10 out of 10. 72 out of 111 ads. I'll. What do you, what do you mean? Eh? I will. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, God. Yet it's hard for me to leave. Uh, a detective never rests. Here's a summary of this playthrough. Your actions are listed here. Play again to make different choices. Note that only major choices are listed. However, even insignificant choices can affect the relationships and brain brawl stats. I'm sorry? Brain brawl stats? Oh my gosh. What is that? What is this? Relationship Brock Graf. <laughs> oh yeah, look at RJ. Yeah, we're best friends. Jeebus. Oh, we disabled. We did. We did the. Uh, oh. Yeah, that makes sense. This. 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 Wow. This is. Denounce leads to negative sin relationship. OK, so you can do better on the exam. That makes sense. How you depicted yourself, killer. I wonder if the game always picked whichever. Uh, what? 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 Sounds 
successfully escaped if I took if it took less than 15 minutes. Oh wow. Okay. Oh wow. Brock arrived on time? No. So I could arrive on time? So I could have arrived on time. This is interesting. Selfie with Graf? No. You can have a selfie with Graf? Dog, this is incredible. Oh, and then chapter three, if he shows up, if, if he lives, You meet the director somewhere other than the school. Hint, arrive on time for the fair. So another thing. Oh, I guess that's if I meet the director at the fair, it leads to this. Oh, wow. There's... Given the chip, yes. Oh, so you cannot. Oh, wow. Bolt screw? Huh. Force clay to get chained. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, so if, because if, if clay gets chained, then we get to here. Pill quest buy. So a lot of, yeah. Hint, Graf doesn't buy a pill. Paid my bills. This is... Last trial win, did Ott leave? Given pursuit. Yeah, okay, I, I was wondering, two si- Is the- is he a scientist? Oh my god, okay. Does RJ survive? Yes. Okay, so if our relationship with R- Okay, wow. Oh! So he could apologize, which could lead to a different- Get the best possible score for all trials. Squealer ambush, and it- Mmm, that's interesting. Sin, oh, so if our relationship was high enough with Sin, he would he would have lived. Graf beats Chief. No. Yeah. Only Ott. And then something. Graf escapes without Ott without fight. Or Graf escapes with Ott without fight. There's an ending. Here's another ending. Here's a whole scene we didn't get that has an ending oh if we if we don't get the truth if we if we screw up that's interesting and there's another ending here defeat the huge bot fight or no defeat west fight or no i guess if we loot hmm uh if our relationship is too low we get an end Wow, this is wild. Unlock all and so there's more scenes if you get all the endings and find all the ads. Uh, a new icon has been added to your progress. Use it to check the summary at any time during your next playthrough. There are 11 endings to unlock and an after credits by unlocking all the ads. Keep in mind, you don't always have to replay the whole game to access them. And I, there's a chapter restart, which is very good. I'm glad to I'm glad to see that. 
I'm glad to see that because that'll make it easier to try to get different endings. This was we apparently got the canon ending. We got we got what they call the 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 canonical ending. We got what they call the canonical ending. It's weird that there's no summary on this screen. So I can see what we've kind of already done. Like there's a roadmap to show you where you missed stuff. Yeah, I, I also like that. What happens if I... So there was a thing here. So hang on, so let's load this save to put us back in the game. And then now on progress, we can see summary. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Okay, so we're here. In front of the machine, we can choose not to, I guess. Uh, so yeah, so there's a secret drawer back here. And yeah, this secret drawer, um, which uh, we need to translate something. Um, in order to access it. Um, I don't know what we have to translate, but ha, huh. this, this is, this is interesting. I'm actually surprised at how many endings there are. Um, I didn't, re I didn't think that there would be like relationship trackers, like This is this is way and and since you can load into a chapter um you can you know like you can go here and you can you know you can load into chapter 1 and say okay well I want to you know I want to change how I deal with the cleaning bot because like that that can affect this or I can not save bolt which does another thing and who knows what that means later on and it's it, it's this is interesting. This is this is a lot more complicated than I thought it was or or not complicated, but it's a lot more involved than I thought it was going to be. Um I don't know if that works. A hundred uh, I'll say. I think there's a lot of stuff in this that f it feels like there's more than there needs to be. Um it, it I don't know. I don't know how to how to how to describe. Um, like it's it's good. It was obviously you know it's obviously well made. It's obviously made by people who really cared, and it doesn't suffer from a lack of quality. You know, like like the 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 game is amazing. There's a lot of stuff later on top of itself. Yeah, like it it, it almost feels like too much stuff happening. You know, it almost feels like too much stuff happening. Um, like, I almost wonder if it, if they should have done the thing and I almost wonder if they should have done, like, if you should have gotten a bad, an early bad ending, you know, that's like, oh yeah, if you do these like reasonable things, you get a bad ending and then you kind of get that thing because the ending where we got knocked out by the rats wasn't an ending it was it was a thing in the game and that was when i thought they were going to start exploring the time travel stuff so i was ready for it and the time travel stuff didn't doesn't come until literally the end you know so it feels like yeah i don't know i don't know i'm, I'm very it was good. It was fun. I, I, I definitely, definitely enjoyed playing through it, but I don't know. I don't know. All right. Um, I'm sure we'll talk about this more. It'll come up. Um, I'm going to take my morning break, though. I'm going to take my morning break. I'm going to go use the restroom, walk Josie, do all that good stuff. Um, I will see you all in... Um, I will see you all in just a little bit. Um, we're going to get up to some, we're going to get up to some random stuff for the rest of the day. 
they could have scrapped half the story beats and it would have ended the same. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it does feel like we could have we could have gotten there a little quicker. But uh, but yeah, uh, I'll be back in just a little bit.